Hello everybody, good day to you all. Today I'm talking about Star Wars, The Bad Bad Season number two, episode number six, Tribe. In this episode here, we got the, the crew and my cousin Omega get up to some shenanigans. But also some something some, something that actually helps out a, 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 a small little Wookiee boy find a new home. Now, just like always, you had the, the, the crew on do have their little mission they're gonna do, and they're gonna do a little drop off with some shady people, get get paid their money and go about their business. But you have Amiga. She has her own plans, her own agendas. And she, she feels like a little icky about the whole situation. She doesn't like what's going on, and you you see what's going to happen because because she's because she's hanging around with um with um what's his name? Is it Havoc? No, not Tech. Uh, she hang around with one 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 of the, uh, the clones, and he she says he said, I'm, I'm gonna go back to the ship to do something, and she says okay. He said wait here. You know you know you know not gonna happen, and then. Craziness happened from there. But because of her curiosity and want to see what's going on, we found this Wookiee named um, Gunji. And this is now Gunji had been introduced before. He, he was in an episode of the Clone Wars series. And seeing him also makes you think about a whole lot of different things. Like, just, uh, is there any other other younglings to survive? Is he the only one? Did the rest of them die? Are there, are there a lot of um, other uh, young Jedi out there? What, what is, um, because the thing is, though, even though this episode was like a one off, and I did enjoy it. I had fun watching it and watching the action sequences and stuff like that as well too. Um, I wonder if this is going to play off later on. Are we going to try to find like other um, young Jedi out there? Is this going to come come into the picture somewhere? Is this just a setup for something else later, more to come, or is this is something that just happened? It was nice because I had fun watching it, but I had no idea where this series is going so far. Because it looked like at first this, this series first started, it looked like it had a direction. Is continuing from the last that episode, and then it's just like then uh, down recently, it's like every episode is like a little one off here, a little one off there. Nothing really connects to one another. I mean, they're fun to watch, but at the same time, I have no idea where the story is going. And even though um I had fun watching this episode, it was it was, it was kind of predictable at times because we already know what's going to happen. Like, this. like once you see a, a Mega do her um her her thing, like I, I go go off on her own, you're like, oh this this is the thing's gonna the story's gonna take a turn here. But you are, you also know everything's gonna wrap up and be be fine. And you you know the man from the from the crew is gonna die, and you know the the, the, the young Jedi he's not gonna die, and you know not Mega's not gonna die. So so you know that you know they're gonna be safe, and whatever they're gonna do, it's gonna work out. It's nice to see other Wookies in this episode here and see them actually was fun. Also it, it, the design and the of the, um, of the new alien creatures that they show, like the, the, the spider like creatures, I really like how they look, even though they look kind of freaky to me. But I still I like the introduction to the new creatures. It's always fun to see new um new alien species in in, in this world. It makes you see that the world is getting like, getting bigger, expanding expanding more. And also the, the creatures that um that the Wookiees were riding as like help help them fight in, in the battle. I thought it was also very interesting. Like like look like a combination between like a like a, a monkey and a cat wolf sort of, sort of like situation. But overall, I I, I had fun watching this episode. Um. Seeing like this young little Wookiee f find a, a home, but like I said, are there other Jedi, young Jedi out there? Are we, are we going to find them? Have them find a home, something like that as well too. It, it, would, the, would the school start again? I don't know, but fun episode. I like I said, I don't, I have no clue where this story is going, at all. But so far, I'm just enjoying this, enjoying the ride. Maybe because the thing is, though, this this could just all just be this one little one offs here and there, or it, it could connect, connect back to the original story of, of where it's going from. And what thing though, what is the show trying to say right now? What 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 like, what is the point of these episodes? Are, are, are they are they going to pay off later on, or is this just fun little things to just to watch? I mean, either way, I'm I'm cool, but I still have to know what we will be doing, like with 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 this. I mean, I'm not. I'm not taking me out of the picture, and I'm not not still enjoying it. But it's just like it's, it's good to have a direction. I feel like I'm feeling like just flopping around and win here. Because so, like, 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 last episode, I didn't like as much. This episode, I, I really I didn't I did enjoy. It. it was a whole lot more more fun. But leave your comments down below. Let me know what you thought of this episode of Star Wars: The Bad Batch. Did you like, did, did you really love it? Are you enjoying the direction this this series is going so far? Or you think it should it, you feel like though it should have the type of story? Cause I know I, cause I know it's going to pay off eventually. But I'm just, I'm just not seeing the, the whole bigger picture right now. I'm just, I just, I don't know where this is going. So, eh. so just like, just leave comments down below. And if you haven't been watching this, I so check it out for yourself. Hope you watching, you enjoy having to watching it too. But give me a chance to like, hit the thumbs up, 
and subscribe to my channel and share. I really do appreciate it. Also, links down below. Make sure my social media. You want to follow me there? Thank you. And also to um, to my stores where I sell things, my shirts, the socks, and everything else and whatnot. Check it out. See some stuff, buy some stuff. This is one of my hoodies right here. This is my I am a Ninja Rabbit hoodie. See some stuff, buy some stuff. I really would appreciate it. Help me out a whole lot. It's like I always say in my dreams of life, I am the Ninja Rabbit. Uh, peace out, uh, people.